Hello friends, how are you? Welcome again on my channel, The Rich Post. Hope you all are doing good. First of all, I want to say you stay home and stay safe and do coding because coding is the best thing. And also, I want to say thank you to all for liking my old Angular admin dashboard videos. Now come to this video. In this video, I came up with how we can easily implement Bootstrap for e-commerce shopping template into our Angular 9 application. And here you can see on my screen that beautiful e-commerce Bootstrap for template I have implemented into my Anglo 9 application. So first I will show you the template look. And friends I will again say please subscribe my channel and also please watch the video till the end for better information. So let's start. And friends now you can see the booster for e-commerce shopping template. And that is in Angular 9. And friends, I can also say this is Angular 9 Booster for e commerce template part 1 because after it I will show you more template section and after it I will come with card page, single product page, checkout page, and also in the end. I will let you know how we can easily integrate payment gateway into our Anglo 9 application. So please subscribe my channel for that. So let's start. And friends, I will also say this template is fully responsive for all the devices, phone and iPods. Let me show you that first. And I will show you for mobile devices first. Pixel 2. So, friends, here you can see it's working fine for Pixel 2 mobile. And now I will show you for iPhone all versions. Look friends. Works well. Now I will show you for iPhone X. Also now I will show you menu toggle. Look friends, now I will show you menu toggle bar. Click on menu first, then you can see. Friends, looks toggle is working fine. Also, the nested navigation, also. And here is simple toggle for English languages and all the languages. Now for iPad. See friends. Working fine for iPad also. And friends I will also say. In this. You will all gain more knowledge. Because after my. Next videos I will share too much like how we can implement the language selector multiple language into our Anglo 9 application and friends this is just a beginning and friends for the coding I will share the code 
snippet links very soon inside the video description then you can get the code easily and friends if you have any kind of query suggestion and requirement then you can comment on this video as well and, and, and you can also contact me via my blog my blog name is therichpost.com and friends if you like this video then please click on like button as well and please also share your views on this in the comment section so thank you friends for watching this video thank you have a nice day